Welcome to Out of Line Weekender Festival 2019, where I'm with uh, Kirlian Camera. Yeah. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, so, how is uh, Kirlian Camera doing? Uh, Kirlian Camera as, as a camera uh, device, you mean? <laughs> the oh. band. <laughs> <laughs> the band. <laughs> oh, okay. Kirlian Camera. Um, we are a little bit changing direction and. Uh, we are coming back to something more pop, electro, rock. That's our uh, source in a way. So um, we are really uh, glad of the Hologram Moon, the last album uh, results and feedback. Uh, so uh, that's just the first time after 15 years that we are kind of glad and satisfied. Um, mm. You know, the band has been around from uh, 79 to 80, so uh, it's an uh, amazing feat. Uh, is it yeah. possible to decide what have been the best moments on that journey? There are two great moments as for myself goes. That's uh, uh, in uh, January 2000, when definitely uh, uh, such a woman <laughs> joined the the band after some problems with the parents <laughs> because she was a little bit too young and so we had to wait uh, one year before definitely uh, get her in the band and then really uh, maybe this exact current here because I repeat, uh, the, holo the hologram moon the feedback and story uh, is going to run so fine. And we are uh, meeting some uh, fantastic person, more or less coming from different scenes, uh, from the rock metal scene mostly. From the metal, for example, two guys uh, working with us now today are, are coming from Hellhammer and uh, the, the Celtic Frost, the Tripticon area, and we are um, thinking something about um, some possible future with uh, maybe with Tripticon and, and, and so on. Uh, our bassist also work with Abbott. That's an uh, immortal thing. So, so we are more connected with the rock metal scene. Uh, Hologram Moon is uh, such an interesting album. Uh, it was the first, I, I believe, a uh, first album in five years that you made. So, how was the writing and recording process? It was very strange in the beginning. We started uh, getting some relation with uh, particular theories. You know, um, yeah. it's a it's a huge album. There's a two CD plus a book version of the album. Uh, it's about the conspiracy that the moon is a hologram. It's a possibility. It's, yeah. Yes. Uh, so um, you wanna uh, elaborate a bit on that? Uh, mm -hmm. So how did you come in contact with this um, topic, and uh, where did it go from there? We got in contact uh, with some um, uh, theory makers. They are um, a astrophysics, you know, uh, uh, some very, um, how can I say, uh, celebrated uh, um, researchers such as Giuliano Conforto or Lanza or. Uh, uh, we st I, I started uh, following some th theories uh, in 1972 and believe me, it was very complicated. <laughs> so. okay. uh, uh, yeah, uh, still about the album. Uh, so now that some time has passed, uh, what are your own feelings about the music? The only important thing is music. You, ha you have feel music, uh, no matter other, other thing, no matter, no matter anything else. But uh, music is uh, what your heart uh, have to tell, to explain. So um, I, li uh, um, 
come io do molta importanza. I attach very importance to the visual. So, if you uh, seeing something, uh, the most beautiful things is uh, transmit something in the in the visual. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I believe in such a things. And then we uh, focus our night in the electronics, but uh, despite of uh, the album, uh, we like the, the live was, uh, is more uh, aggressive. So we need uh, uh, bass, bass guitar, guitar bass, uh, uh, guitar, yeah, in order to, to make more aggressive sound uh, in the very beloved uh, electronics <laughs> okay okay thank you so much and uh, i can't wait to see you all play and uh, it was it was an honor okay. thank, you. thank you for your patience <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much okay okay sorry but today we were